Today I'm going to make a farm diorama. On this farm we have lots of trees. Trees are good for the environment. Trees make the air we breathe. Here is a cow shed. Here is a barn. Here is a pond. Now let's add some sand banks to the pond. Let's add some plants to the pond. Now let's add some pebbles and rocks to the pond. Here comes the farmer in his truck. He's driving a red truck. Here comes the cattle. We have a bull. It's a male cow. This cow has horns. Let's let this bull out of the trailer. Let's put this bull over by the cow shed in the field. Here comes the farmer. He has more cattle. Here comes the bulls. This is a dairy cow. And this is a bull with horns. Here come more cattle. When you have more than one cow, you can call them cattle. This cow looks thirsty. I think he needs a drink of water from the pond. Here is another thirsty cow. The farmer driving his truck and trailer with more cattle. Let's open the trailer gate to let out the cattle. These are female cows. They are the mothers. There goes the farmer with his truck and trailer to get more animals. Here comes the farmer. He has more cows. Look, we have a stray. It's another cow. Now let's let out the other cows out of the trailer. These are Holstein cows, also known as dairy cattle. Here we have another cow. This is a brown cow. Wow, look at all the cattle on the farm today. Let's put the cattle over by the cow shed. Here comes the farmer. He has some baby cows, also known as calves. I wonder how many calves there are. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven calves on the farm today. The calves are looking for their mothers. I think they found them. Aw, look at all the baby cows with their mothers and fathers. On this farm, there are horses. Look at this beautiful black horse. What a beautiful black horse. She has red ribbons in her mane and in her tail. There are her hooves. Let's put this horse next to the big red barn. 
Here is another horse. This is a black and white horse. Here comes another horse. Look at the ribbons in the mane. And look at the braided tail. You can see the horseshoes. Here comes the foal or baby horse. This horse also has a ribbon in its tail. Here comes another four-hoofed animal. These are ungulates. It's a donkey, a gray donkey. Now let's open the barn doors to see what's in the barn. Oh look, oh my goodness, it's an alpaca. It's a cute, shy alpaca. Alpaca in the barnyard. What do we see next? It's a pig, a cute little piglet. And here, is its mother. There they go to play in the barnyard. Up next we have this cute little sheep. And look, here is its mother. It's a baby sheep, also known as a lamb. Thanks for joining me here at the farm today where we have horses, donkey, pigs, sheep, alpaca, and cows. Look at all the cattle. Subscribe to Cotton Candy Corner for more animal videos. Thanks for watching. Bye. Today we're going to build a cow shed. I have these wooden dowels and we just have to cut them in half to make the posts. I have some wooden craft sticks and some long grass that I picked outside. Remember to have your parents help you with hot glue and sharp scissors and objects. We have a cow shed. Let's put out the big red barn that I made with paint sticks. Yeah. It's a Texas Longhorn. Texas Longhorn horns can span up to eight foot long. This is a bull. There are its hooves. They are ungulates. Now let's make a pond for the animals. Some sand to make the banks by the pond. Now let's dig a well.
Now let's build a platform for the water pump. Here comes the water pump. Let's pump some water into the pond. Here comes the cowgirl on her horse. She's bringing the cattle in from the field. Here comes another girl. She's riding her horse. She's herding in all the goats from the pasture. The cowgirl is on her horse and the goats are headed towards the barnyard. There is a duck in the pond. And look, there are some little ducklings. It looks like the duck and ducklings are enjoying the water. Thanks for watching my farm animal video. Subscribe to Cotton Candy Corner if you like animals as much as I do. See you in my next video. Bye. Huh? No water. We have water.
Let's build a fun safari diorama. Here is our safari station. Here is a tree and river. The river is what feeds the water into the pond. Let's add some sand around the pond. Look, up in the station, there is a safari ranger. The safari ranger is waiting for all the animals to arrive. What kind of animal do we have first? It's an elephant. Elephants use their trunks much like we use our hands. It looks like she's looking for food. Here comes her baby. There are two babies. I think they're hungry. Oh look, I think she spotted some grass in the sand near the pond. Here comes a hungry baby. She's picking up the grass with her trunk, just like we would use our hands to pick up things. Oh, she's showing off her prize to the other baby elephant. Ah, look, they're sharing the grass. Here comes the safari vehicle. They're checking out the elephants. There they go to look for more animals. The two rangers spot giraffe over by the acacia tree. What animals do we have next? Here comes the rangers in their vehicle. Oh look, there are zebra. We have a family of zebras. Let's take the zebra out of the trailer. Did you know that zebras can run up to 65 kilometers per hour? Zebras each have their own unique pattern of stripes. Zebras look much like a horse. Here come the rangers with more safari animals. We have lions. Now let's bring the lions out. Here is a male lion. Here is a female lion called a lioness. There is another female lion and its cub. There they go, looking for food. It looks like they found more lions. I think we better feed them. It looks like the lions were very hungry. Oh look, what popped up? Two meerkats. The meerkat uses its tail to balance when standing upright. You better watch out meerkats. Here comes a rhinoceros. Rhinoceros have awesome giant horns that grow from their snouts. I think this rhinoceros is looking for some food. What do we have here? There are chimpanzees. They're at the ranger station. I think they enjoy the company of the ranger. Here come the okapi. Okapi are known as the forest giraffe and the only living relative to the giraffe. Thanks for watching my fun safari animal video where we have giraffes, okapi, elephants, we also have chimpanzee, zebra, and lions. Near the water's edge we have a rhinoceros and two cute little meerkats. Don't forget to subscribe to Cotton Candy Corner for more animal videos. Don't forget to subscribe. We have the farmhouse. Next, we have the big red barn. Now let's add some fencing for the barnyard animals.
Let's add another tree to the farm. What's a farm without cats? Look, this one is looking up in the trees. Here comes another cat under the big tree. We have one more cat. And we have some kittens. Aw, look, the one is crawling under the log. Here comes the green tractor. Look, there are cattle in the trailer. Let's open the trailer doors. Here is the baby cow or calf. Let's put it into the corral. Here is another cow. Here is a male cow. Did you know there are over 800 different cattle breeds around the world? Here comes the farmer in his tractor. This time he has a trailer full of pigs. Now let's open the gates. And look, we have two adult pigs and three piglets. Let's open the barn doors for the animals. Here goes one of the pigs into the barnyard. And here is another pig. Here is a cute little baby pig or a piglet. And look, there are two more baby pigs. There are five pigs in the barnyard today. Look what else I found on the farm today. It's a goose. We also have sheep. There are four sheep. I see three lambs and one mother sheep. Here comes a dog. This is a Border Collie. Border Collies help when herding the animals like sheep and cows. Thanks for joining me here at the farm today. There are lots of animals to see on the farm, like the rabbits. We also have cattle, pigs in the big red barn. There is a dog and some sheep. In the pond, we see ducks. And over by the tree, there are some cats. See you next time here at Cotton Candy Corner. Today we're going to build a cow shed. We have a pole barn and we have some thatch. This will go on top of the cow shed. Let's put some strapping on the thatch. Now let's add the thatch to the pole barn. I'm going to put the cow shed in the white fence corral for the cows. Let's put this hay into the cow shed. Here comes the farmer in his John Deere side by side. He has a cow, look. Cows have incredible eyesight. They see nearly everything around them without moving their heads. Look, it's a cow near the cow shed. Here comes the farmer with another cow. Look, it's a black and white cow. Cows are four-footed. One, two, three, four. And they have very large bodies. Moo, says the cow. The farmer is backing up the side-by-side. -side. He has a horse. It's a brown horse. Let's put the horse by the big red barn. Hop, hop, hop. What do we have here? Why, it's a green frog in the pond. Moo. Here comes another cow. This one has horns. Oink, oink, oink. Here comes a pig. It's a pig and a cow. Baroom, here comes the farmer. What does he have? He has a black and white 
cow with brown horns. Let's put the cow in the cow shed. And look, in the field, here comes a sheep with a yellow face. Swimming down the river, we have a yellow duck with an orange beak. Over by the big red barn, here comes a chicken with an orange beak. Here comes a donkey. It's a gray donkey. Look at the big tall ears on this donkey. And you can see its tail and its mane. Donkey. Oink, oink, oink. Here comes another pig. Oh, look how cute this pig is. It has a pink nose, pink ears, pink tail, and a pink body. Pigs live on farms. I'm going to put the pink pig near the cow shed with the cows. Did you know that cows are herbivores, meaning they eat plants? Thanks for watching my farm animal video with cows and a cow shed. We also have pink pigs, a frog and a duck in the water. Over in the field, we have a sheep. It's air safari. We're going on an African safari. Here come the African safari guides. They're transporting African animals. We have great apes. Gorillas are native to East Central and West Africa. Chimpanzees are great apes, native to the forest of savanna and tropical Africa. Africa also has many different kinds of monkeys. These safari guides are observing animals in their natural habitat. Here come the elephants. There are two different African species, African forest elephant and African bush elephant. They are herbivores. Herbivores eat plants. Rhinoceros, a very large, thick-skinned animal. Zebras, they're social animals. They spend time in herds. Meerkats are small mongoose found in Southern Africa. Let's feed the lions. Here comes a lion. Lions are large cats. Lions have a round head and round ears. Their tan color allows them to blend in with their surroundings. Lions live in savannas, woodlands, and deserts. Lions live in groups called prides. This one has a healthy appetite. Here comes a giraffe. Giraffes are large African hoofed mammals. Mammals are warm-blooded animals. Okapi, known as the forest giraffe. Active during the day, Okapi prefer to be alone. Sometimes Okapi congregate in small groups to eat, groom, and play. Flamingo. Flamingos are pink in color. They make their nests in mud. There are five different species of sea turtle in African waters. Thanks for watching my African safari animal video. We saw lions, zebra, giraffe, elephants, chimpanzees, and monkeys. We also saw flamingo, sea turtle, 
gorilla, meerkats, and okapi. Thanks for watching Cotton Candy Corner, where we saw animals on a safari. Hi boys and girls, today we're going to build a barn. We have all the pieces. We have a big red barn. Let's add this house for horses or horse stable. Now let's add some grass and some fencing. Clydesdale horse. Look at the long hair on the bottom of the legs of these horses. This is called feather or feathering and it protects the bottom of their legs from rough terrain and brambles. Clydesdale horse. Clydesdale horse have strong hind quarters, great for pulling. Clydesdale are a heavy draft horse breed. They originated in Scotland near the river Clyde. Clydesdale horses are taller and weigh much more than a regular horse. Let's add some more fencing to the farm for the cows. Here comes some cows. These are Angus. They're a small breed of Scottish cattle. Cows are grass-eating mammals. Here comes a Texas longhorn. The horns on the Texas longhorn can span to over eight foot across. Here comes a cow. And here comes another cow. This is a baby cow. This baby cow or calf can also be called a yearling if it's in its first or second year. On this farm there is a dog. This is a corgi. The corgi is in the horse stable. Here comes a pig. Pigs are also called hogs or swine. Male pigs are called boar. Pigs have a reputation of being dirty, but they're actually quite clean. Pigs love to roll in the mud to cool off. Pigs live in cool, covered environments. They like to stay very clean. Goat. Goats were one of the first animals to be tamed and herded by humans over 9,000 years ago. Goats can be taught their name and to come when called. This is a baby goat also called Kid. Here is another Kid. This one is wearing a bell. There are lots of cattle on this farm. There is a dog in the horse stable. There are also horses in the paddock and pigs in their little shelter and goats on top of the pig shelter. Thanks for watching my farm animal video. Don't forget to subscribe. We have a mini barn. Now let's make a mini farm. We have some fencing. I have some cotton candy. Now let's make a pool with the blue cotton candy. Wow, look at this cotton candy. Let's make a pond with the cotton candy. Now we have a pond for the animals. Let's add some kinetic sand around the pond so that we can make the banks.
I'm going to add some foliage around the pond. Here come the animals. Look, it's a gray horse. Next to the pond. Behind the red barn, there is a chicken. Next to the barn, there is a goat eating some grass. Behind the barn, there is a turkey. Here comes a cow. It's a black and white cow next to the big red barn. Here comes a pink pig. Here comes another chicken. Here comes a dog. And way over in the pasture, there is the farmer in his truck. Thanks for joining me here on my mini farm. See you in my next video.